Welcome to Final Resting Place. Today we visit Mayflower Hill Cemetery in Taunton, Massachusetts to find serial killer Jane Toppin. Jane is buried in a potter's field at the back of the cemetery between St. Joseph and Mayflower Hill. In 1854, Jane was born to Irish immigrants Peter and Bridget Kelly. Her birth name was Honora Kelly. Honora was the youngest of three girls, Nellie the oldest and Delia the middle child. Mom Bridget died of tuberculosis when Honora was still very young, leaving Peter to raise the girls. Peter was an abusive alcoholic and was unable to raise the children. Honora became an orphan and around the age of 10 was sent to Anne Toppin's home along with another foster child named Elizabeth to be an indentured servant until the age of 18. Although Honora got along with Elizabeth, she did not have a good relationship with Anne. Anne did not care for Irish immigrants and changed Honora's name to Jane Toppin. Shortly after Jane turned 18, Anne died and left her entire estate to Elizabeth and her husband. Elizabeth hired Jane as a housekeeper. At 31 years old, Jane moved on from housekeeping to become a nurse. In 1887, Jane began working at Cambridge Hospital, where she earned the name Jolly Jane for her stocky build and her bright character. Shortly after, she became fascinated by autopsies, arousing something inside her. Jane then began using her patients as test subjects, injecting morphine and atropine, bringing her patients in and out of consciousness. Eventually, as the patient would be slipping into death, Jane would climb into bed with them and begin to fondle and kiss them, gaining some sort of sexual arousal from it. This went on for four years at Cambridge before she accepted an offer from Massachusetts General Hospital, where the pattern continued. From there, she went on to private nursing care, in 1895, killing her landlord, followed by his grieving wife. In 1899, poisoning her foster sister with strychnine and eventually killing her. In 1901, Jane rented a cottage from the Davis family, killing four members of the family within a month. A family member demanded autopsies. Before the autopsies were complete, Jane had moved in with Elizabeth's husband, where she murdered the new housekeeper. Arrested for the Davis murders, Jane pleaded guilty by reason of insanity and was sent to the State Lunatic Hospital at Taunton, now known as Taunton State Hospital. Jane admitted to killing at least 33 people, but admits there were probably more that she just couldn't recall, and that one of the reasons she committed these horrific acts was that it fulfilled her sexual impulses. Jane is buried at grave marker 984, locating 981 and 986 with approximately four feet between markers, Jane's final resting place is within this area.